Hey folks, as soon as I saw the Earth footprint jump on top of 11429, you just had a feeling that we had one last go before she turned a limb. Well, she put out an M flare not too long ago, and it was right on top of the Earth footprint. Immediately, we had a particle flux, both electrons and protons, visible on both the ACE and the GOES monitors. We are currently in an S2 solar radiation storm. Now, as we have a look at the corona mass ejection associated with the flare, take a look at the ripple effect through the corona. This was one of those coronal mass ejections that was really widespread. The material goes everywhere. Now as we pause here, take a look at the outermost part of the ejection. There's not exactly a hole in the middle of that, folks. There's some coming right at us, uh, hidden behind the disk, probably two to three days away. You also know that we are in the midst of a fairly significant planetary conjunction, Venus and Jupiter coming together in the night sky, and we just had something interesting happen to the solar wind. It cut off from over 600 kilometers per second to under 300, and that type of drastic shift can be just as, uh, just as important for looking at the magnetosphere. Haven't had an earthquake in the six-point range or higher in a couple of days, so maybe we'll have to watch out for that even before the 322 date you're all watching. That's the update, folks. Be safe.